Hey guys, it's Sean and welcome back to Elden Ring part 12. In the last video, we defeated Ranala, Queen of the Full Moon, and we completed the Rey Lucaria Academy, the main location, the main castle in the region Lernia of the Lakes, or Lernia, or however you say it. I'm sure you guys have been correcting me. I don't know. We also tried to scale the Divine Tower of Lernia, and we're thwarted by probably the hardest, or not the hardest, the most frustrating enemy I've faced in this game, the Preceptor Miriam or whatever. So that's where we are right now. Finger Reader Crone. <laughs> what? That's weird that it puts the Finger Reader right here. It's like, oh, you're not going to want to forget about this NPC. Anyway, we're not done with Learning of the Lakes yet. We've got some Everjail bosses to take out. Uh, we've still got this bastard in the Black Knife Catacombs. Is he keeping track of the NPCs for me now? Oh, I think this is part of the- this is part of the update! The game just updated. Muriel Pastor of Vows. I was like, that's weird, I've never seen that before. Cool, it tells you where the NPCs are. Look! There's a nomadic merchant over here. And look! There's, a uh, Bok the Seamster. Sorcerer Thops. Anyway, uh, we're gonna be doing a lot of stuff, though. We're gonna be checking out some Everjail bosses. Trying to wrap up the region a little bit. I think is what my plan is here. Uh, try to tackle some bosses, go through some caves, maybe do some NPC quests. Uh, we'll just see what happens, where the wind takes us. And actually, didn't Thops want us to do something? He, he, didn't he say, like, go to Rhea Lucaria and get me something? I can't remember what he wanted us to get him, but we we probably got it. I, I was there for a long time, and I picked up... Uh, a million different things, so... Yeah, maybe we'll go see what he wants, or... Maybe he can, um, remind me of what he wanted or needed. Sup, Thops? Dude, I have done so much. I've been just riding around everywhere, and you've been sitting on this sorry bench this whole time. Back to learn another. Wonderful. You're most welcome to any of my anemic little spells. Okay. About Selen. You've taken an apprenticeship with Selen. I sure well, have. Something. Selen was well known. The most promising sorceress in the history of the Academy. Are you serious? I followed her at school. But there may as well have been an ocean between us. Oh, but no. Selen was expelled from the Academy, accused of unthinkable treatment of certain sorcerers under the name of the Graven Witch. The Graven I Witch. I don't believe the accusations. The illustrious Selen would never do such things. Remember when we saw her as prisoner? I don't know why that really disturbs me. Let's give him the Glintstone key, sure. So you found yourself a Glintstone key. I sure and have. I certainly can't take it from you. What? That key belongs to you. By right, you should use it for yourself. I have. It's true. I wish to return to my place of study, but that's no excuse to impose upon others. Dude, oh. it's seriously... Is this why Bluntstones always finish last? Dude, it, it literally is not a big deal. I've already I've already used it. Head to the Academy of Rhea Lucaria. No, I've already done that. with your journey. Press forward with your fight. Oh, Don't you do finish last. Up for my sake. You do finish last because you put yourself there. Ugh. He's putting himself there, dude. Anyway, you just sell Pebble, Arc, and uh, Starlight. Well, that's not great, is it? I'll just learn all my sorcery from Selen. How about that? Okay. Interesting. Let's fight the Erdtree Avatar. It's always a fun time. Right? Always a fun time for sure. Surely. We all have fun. Okay. Okay. Well, that was good. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. 
stupid urn tree avatar. Let's go to the Steak of America, please. I wish I was born in a steak house. I love steak so much. Okay. Sneak up on the urn tree avatar. Sneaky. Nice, dude. That's pretty good. Okay. Dude, the fire is insane. Do you see the fire damage? Oh, hang on. Um, let's get that, and let's get this too. Woo. Yeah. Oh, we don't want to do that. Okay. Damn. Okay, we just need... Oh! Get it! <laughs> I basically just did like... I did like six total moves. That was fun. Cerulean Crystal Tear. Ruptured crystal tears. Dude, you get like good tears um, From these things. I'm sorry. Did you not just see what I did to your little urn tree avatar? You want to mess with me? That's what I thought a uh, be gone foul beast <laughs> who, who do you think you are messing with me? All right, I respawned at the Revengers shack and I believe we're gonna be going along the side of the cliff where there are nice jellyfish. Hello, my favorites. Hello, friends. They're just vibing. That's what I like about them. They're just vibing. Give me a good Ash of War. Sword dance. Ow. Oh, really? I love it. <laughs> you know what's funny? This is after the uh, first patch where they actually nerfed this weapon I'm using. They actually nerfed this. This is post nerf. Isn't that crazy? What? Here. That's good. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, did I interrupt your nap? Uh, get it. Golden Rune 5, sure, sure, sure. There's also a big gravestone here. What's this all about? A lot of big gravestones. Behold, head. Yes, a headstone, I guess. I guess you're right. And there's a cave, nice. This will be good. Let's go inside. Roads end catacombs. And I already see blood stains. I see a lot of blood stains, actually. Um, how are there so many blood stains? Oh, yeah? I just love it. Why, why even bother fighting? Listen, we've gone, we've, we've suffered much throughout this playthrough. And I, right now I'm just going to really embrace the ease of use. Although really, I mean, we're just saving ourselves three sword slashes. 
It's not really even saving us that much. You think about it. There's already. We've already got it. The crank. Now there's a lot of glove warts in here. Which I would like to get, actually. There's a lot of glove warts. We okay? Grave glove wart two. Three. Uh, we got two threes. Interesting. Um, that was pretty good. Hello, friend. Stop throwing those rocks at me. You know it won't end well. Okay, where's the heavy door? Is it in here? What a... What a dickhead. What's this? Grave Glove Wart 2. Let's not get ambushed here. Another, another one. And another one. Rank 3 this time though. Is this... Wow, aren't y'all proud of me? I found an illusion wall. What about this? I just felt like teaching him a lesson, you know? Oh wow, what could this be, y'all? <laughs> oh. Oh. But they were disguised so well, they looked exactly like statues. Alright. Rhea Lucaria Soldier Ashes. Huh. Where's the heavy door in here? I actually don't know where it is. Oh my god. So this is like the hidden wall cave, man. There's a rune arc here too. That, that's not nothing. It's like you gotta listen for where you hear the walking. Ooh. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> this is actually really cool. It's like I haven't I haven't run into many illusory walls, so it's like all of a sudden they were just like, "Yep. You're going to have to uh Use a bunch of them. Interesting. There's actually, there's a stake here too. Stake of America. Aha, uh -huh. okay, strong foe. Seek light. Stealth ahead. Seek edge. Really? Spirit Caller Snail. That's not what I had in mind, dude. Oh my god. Wait, the Spirit Caller Snail... Wait, this isn't- it, it's HP. The spirit caller- oh, you're the spirit! You're the spirit! I figured that out too late. I looked at how much of his HP disappeared with the little flame attack and I got really excited. Seek light. This? 
Oh my god! It's the spirit caller snail! It's over here! <laughs> they love these Witch of Hemwick battles. You're doing a great job. Okay, you did an awesome job. Oh, oh, the jellyfish is dead. The jellyfish did an awesome job, as it turns out. Well, I mean, it's over. Oh. oh okay, you finally died. Glintstone Sorcerer Ashes. Nice, we got some ashes out of that. Okay. Dude, when I saw, like, what was it, Spirit Collar Snail? And I saw the big knight, I was like, I guess his name is Snail? So the snail was calling the spirits. I got it. I got it now. Perfect. Another cave, another boss, done. Another level in Vigor. Finally got, so I'm level 59 now. Um, you know, I was reading online because I was wondering about like recommended levels. A lot of people say like you recommend to be around level 60 before going to Caleb. So I'm about there. Um, considering I've been like going everywhere that I've been able to and doing anything that I've been able to. Going in every cave, fighting every optional boss, doing every side quest. Uh, you know, I've been worried that I've been a little over leveled. I'm, and I still might be. Whatever that, whatever your, you know, um, standard for that is, but, uh, okay, how we doing, actually, okay, let's do the, but it seems like, in many people's opinion, I'm not, so I will take that. Oh, ball, uh, bowls, carrying knife. That actually didn't do anything to him. You know, it makes sense. The fire attack, though, the fire attack worked. Okay. Let's get this. Wow. He is a knight great and powerful. That's not, that's not it. Oh, jeez. Damn. I tried to, uh, dodge roll that. of America, jeez. I hate to say this, but you know when I did that strong attack by his leg just now? It kind of seemed like that was doing like about as much damage as the long wind up fire attack, which while cool, you know, uh, the fire attack while cool, maybe not the most efficient, See, like that? Oh my god. Can I get him? Right here? Wow, okay. 
I staggered him pretty good. Please get up. Let's go this way. <laughs> there we go. Come here. Get him. Oh no. I was drinking. You ever like achieve one of your goals? And then you're just like, wait, it actually wasn't that great. Uh, it wasn't as great as I thought it would be achieving this goal. No, all of your goals have been completely, utterly satisfactory. Okay, all right, great conversation. He just hit the invisible wall. Can I get in there? Oh my god. I couldn't get to the helmet. Very frustrating. Blade Phalanx. Nice, we got a new spell out of it and like 4,600 runes. That's okay. I mean, I've had better. Dude, I just realized, do you think this could beat the Crucible Knight? Or no, you think... You think maybe... <laughs> you think maybe I could cheese the Crucible Knight with this? Okay, we got another Ever Jail at the far north Lyurnia, and uh, I'm gonna check it out. I actually don't even know what's in here. I didn't know it was in the last one either, actually. I just kind of noted that there was ever jails here, and then I kind of just pieced out. Okay. Holy fuck. What the hell? This, the, the fire one takes too long. Look at this guy. He's something like interdimensional. Shit, why'd you dodge that? Oh, that was good. That was good. Onyx Lord is his name, by the way. Lord of what, dude? Oh. Oh. Wow, well, that was tricky, dude. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so... Mm-hmm.
fuck. Doing it. Yeah. Got him. Hey, meteorite, that's the spell he was casting. Now it's mine. Now I can summon an interdimensional vortex for meteorites to come through. Jeez. Can you imagine disrupting the galactic flow that much? Be like, hey, these, the trajectory of these meteorites is now under my control. I've decided the meteorites are going to hit this guy I don't like. Imagine the calculations you'd have to make to put a vortex, like a portal, in the path of a bunch of meteorites and then put the other portal right in front of some dude you don't like. And then be like, now the meteorites will hit him. Yeah. Like what? Can you imagine? That guy was doing all sorts of mathematical equations in his head. It's really impressive if you think about it, and uh, it's the type of thing that probably goes unnoticed to a lot uh, less savvy eyes, we'll just say. All right, so we're back at the uh, Three Sisters area. You know, it's called the Three Sisters. We've got Rena, Ronnie, and then Celevis, which is weird, right? Since when are you a sister? I don't care if you do watch James Charles. Let's go lie to him real quick and tell him, uh, tell him that we, uh, gave Nephili the, uh, potion, because remember, he was like, give her this poison, basically. Eh. Ah, so you made Nephili drink the potion. Uh-huh. Well done. You are a touch more useful than I had thought. Yeah, Very sure. Very well. Then you shall have your gift. What is it? Knowledge of the sorceress arts and of the tutelage of the great preceptor Salavis. I doubt much of it will lay within the grasp of a mere tarnished, but Dude. if you put your mind to it, perhaps you won't embarrass our lady. Is there any way that I can kill this guy? You wish to begin right this moment? Well, your impatience, though boorish, is understandable. Let's have at it. So annoying. What do you even know? Carrion failings. 12,000? You want 12,000 for that? Carrion retaliation. Glintstone ice crag. Freezing mist. Wow. Intelligence of 34. Oh, okay. Big brain over here. Now let's ask him about Nefeli. So, you had Nefeli drink the potion? Truly? Hmm. Then perhaps something was amiss with it. It's concocted from the finest ingredients, but perhaps I should review the recipe. I may have expected too much of her to begin with. Ah, uh, there is no way, dude. There is no way that this guy isn't up to no good. That's all I have to say about that. Oh, Rena's Rise is actually still blocked off. What's that about? Look. Yeah, yeah, you don't have the right. Blocked shut for now. What's even in there? There's like a big ladder and stuff. How do you get in there? Okay. If Blind's at the festival, then I guess we'll just leave it at that for now. I don't know. Um, okay, so I beat the two Everjail bosses. I uh, discovered a cave over here, and we fought a cool boss. I can't remember what it was now. But it was cool, wasn't it? Um, I'm trying to think of like what else. I, I haven't really been over here. We could try to beat the Erd Tree thing again. Oh, wait. Well, there's the Black Knife Catacombs. Ugh. There's a there's actually a tower over here that if I think if we put on the statue head, then we can go in if we do a certain gesture, right? 
That might be worth checking out. Here I go. This guy. Oh. Hi. Wow. Find this guy again right now. I mean, he just one shot me again. Ugh. I just I saw him there and he was pissing me off, so I decided to fight him. Carlos Glenstone Crown. It's actually worse in a lot of ways than this one, but this is what we would have on. Look at me! Look how stupid I look! I look so dumb. Anyway, I just, I saw this guy over here, and he was just pissing me off. He's just standing there like a doofus, so I thought I'd kill him. Well. Try to get this up. Jeez. That's good. You are pissing me off. I hate this guy. There you go. Oh, I'm so sorry. Did you die? Fuck you. Give me a good item. You don't give me anything, do you? Nothing. Can I go in now? Yeah. No. May erudition light the way. So wait, is it... Prayer? Is that what did it? Did do that? With the, with the head? Or no? Okay. I actually, I, I looked up what to do. Something I'm not ashamed of, mind you. And, uh, unfortunately... Well, I did find the majority of things in Rhea Lucaria. There's one thing that I didn't find, even though I walked right past it. And it's something that has to do with something that we did in this very video. I'll let you know whenever we get there. Trust me, you're gonna be mad. I'm mad. Okay, so you remember this place, right? Remember when I was up here? Well, see that? Yeah. That's apparently what I need. This right here is apparently... Oh! Why did you hop like that? Here, look. Here, look. This is a normal jump. 
Yeah, cool. This was the jump that my guy just did. Whoa! Whoa! I'm gonna just jump all over the place willy nilly. <laughs> Look at this. Okay, now we're just gonna calmly drop onto the chandelier, apparently. Oh, wow, that's all we had to do. Academy Glintstone Key! Remember when I was here earlier? Yeah, I do too. I did it. Great. So now we can give this to Thops or whatever, and he gives us a gesture, and that's the gesture that we use at that tower. I'm not making this up. It would be funny if I was, though. It would be funny, admittedly, it would be really funny if I was making it up. That's a good point that you made, and I responded to. Here I go. We're gonna give Thops the, uh, extra glintstone key, since he's being so weird about it. Here, look, I've got two glintstone keys for no reason. One of them was on a chandelier, you won't believe it. Back to learn another? No. Why, of course? No, no, no. Yeah. Are you certain you're willing to give your glintstone key to me? I have two, dude, why, just take why? it. Thank you. Thank you dearly. Now I can go back to the academy. Please. To resume my study of glintstone sorceries. And the very stars. I hope you have a statue head because they won't let you in without it. Erudition. There it is. Back to learn another. Why, of course. Okay. So now... Now we can go back to this thing. And now we can do the erudition. Um, ooh, that was close. Erudition. Um, gesture is what they're called. I, almost, I always want to call them emotes. And now I can finally see what's in this place. Oh, you do have to have a glintstone crown on it, but it doesn't seem to matter what kind. Is the giant back? No, he's a one and done. You kill him one time and he never comes back. Huh. This better be good. Huh? Better be good. All right, here we go. Now, right here, we're gonna do it right here. Oh no. No, we don't actually wanna do that. Let's switch out Rapture for Erudition. Okay. Yeah? Yeah? The seal on the rise opened. Thank God. About fucking time. Now, guess what? I'm gonna take this off. Don't need it anymore, thank you. Enemies? Treasures? NPCs, perhaps? What the fuck? Oh! It's just one of these things. How about this? Oh, you like that? How about this? Oh, yeah? Bye-bye. What was that all about, you know? <sighs> we'll just keep going then. Just had to drink a bunch. I have a problem, I guess. Really thirsty all the time. For mysterious flasks. Full of colored potions. They gotta be colored. It's gotta be red, blue, green. Not gonna drink any clear liquids like water. That's out of the question. <gasps> Kenan of Hyma. Gavel of Hyma. Ooh, two new spells. I might use them. How did you die? Did you just. How did you die? You just. Why would you jump right there? Just to get your blood stain to show up and be like, yeah, that was me that did that stupid shit. That's me. Hey, you see that person doing something completely dumb? Yeah, that's me. Do you wanna like, take out the Erdtree avatar? We've already killed one. There's another one over here, I'm pretty sure. Or, uh, can I just hop down? I think I can. Yeah, the minor Erdtree. I mean, it's pretty simple, right?
Is there an Earth Tree Avatar? There sure is. Hell yeah, I'm gonna get the uh, jellyfish. Bro, doing fire damage is crazy. Oh, you wanna try that again? Okay. Could I please? I can't. I was like, okay, this is a horrible place for me to be. I'm not trying to make excuses. Look at these guys. Blank. 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 Okay. Hey, idiot. <laughs> yeah. It's okay, they're dumb. Hey, you guys ever been to the Siofra River well? No? It's beautiful down there. You should think about it. There's a bunch of dead guys that look like you down there. <laughs> okay. Let's, uh... We got jellyfish. Let me get my runes. Real quick. There we go. Okay. That did a absolutely ridiculous amount of damage, by the way, and I loved it. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. Up, 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 up. Okay. There we go. Pretty big uh, attack there. And uh, that's that. I saved you, jellyfish. I saved you. Magic shrouding cracked tear. Lightning shrouding cracked tear. Holy shrouding cracked tear. I got three cracked tears. The cracked tears are for the uh, uh, flask of wondrous physic, by the way, if you've forgotten, which you would be, you would be absolutely forgiven for forgetting what they do. Um, they're they're pretty rare items. They just don't really pop up much. You know, I haven't really been over here much. I wonder if there's any caves or like sites of, sites of grace or anything maybe around. Okay, we're killing these guys because they're stomping a lot. You see what they're doing? They like doing this. They like doing this shit. They were doing this in the Siofria river well. It's not Siofria. Siofra is how you pronounce it. Okay. Now, you know what's weird? There's two of these right next to each other. There's this one and then this one. That's weird, right? They're right next to each other. Now, I haven't taken these things out yet. I'm wondering if I can, because like before I was like, oh, maybe you hop on top, but it seems really hard to coordinate that. I wonder if you attack them. They usually seem pretty peaceful, or at least the one... See, look. But then they do this. The one in the uh, Weeping Peninsula was pretty... You know, peaceful, but this one though jumps up and down. I don't think 
it. I mean, it's like rock, dude. I don't know, man. Maybe there's a way to bring him down. Dude, it like blocked out the sun just now. Holy crap. Ooh, there's actually a side of grace right here. That'll make it easier to come over here. I can't believe I missed this earlier. Thanks, dude. Yeah, okay. I'm trying to figure out if there's like something else that I'd like to, to do. I'll uh, pipe down over there. Ooh, there's a cave over here then. Anytime you see one of these guys, they're pointing to a cave. And they're real smug about it too. Yeah. That way, you say. I actually, I don't think I've been over here. This'll do it. Is it, is it like just on the side right here? Oh. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I haven't been over here. If there's a cave, that makes sense. Um, who was that? Leave me alone. Oh my god, it's the vulgar militia, guys. Give me a break. Am I right? Yeah! Okay, I was about to say. It seemed like it was pointing this way. Yellow. Cliff bottom catacombs. Okay. We are at the bottom of a cliff, so very accurate name so far. Very impressive. Oh, wow. Okay. This is kind of odd, isn't it? Oh, you can hop off right there. That's what we want to do. Yeah. Grave Glove Wart 2. And then we'll hop down. Um. Oh, look. Look who's here. Look, he's like, oh, I'll just pretend to be AFK. Oh, wow. Look at you. At the ready. I hate these goblin things, man. I'll take that. This. Root resin. Thrilling. You just... Nothing compares to finding some root resin. Keep hearing little feetsies. Why do I feel like they're over here? Come on. Dead. Love wart. <laughs> Be wary of left. Why? What's up? Are you sure? What's happening on the left? Should I just go? I just want to see if there's an illusory wall. There's not. Here we go. Here we go. Be wary of left. There's nothing on the left. Down. Oh, there's something down there. What is that? I don't know what that is. It's some kind of beast. It wants me to jump down. Huh. Bro, I'm gonna need you to cool down, cool down. Okay. Hi. Oh, this is where the trap is, my bad. Huh. Oh, there's a mist here for like stone sword keys. 
What the hell? It's one of these guys. I haven't fought them. Oh, that's so good. I think this is one of the guys that was in the Stormvale Castle Courtyard. And I think he was down there, too. Just now, you could fall down and fight another one. Hmm. Uh, well, let's put this up. I may not have the required stone sword key here. What, you need one? Oh, you need two? Oh, no, you just need one. Come on, I use the stone sword key. You have to get the dialogue box to disappear. Here we go. Nox Mirror Helm. Really? That sounds pretty good, actually. I mean, it's got mirrors. Must be good. Look at this. The weight is pretty good pretty hefty. It's actually very good against magic, fire, lightning, and holy. But I prefer my black wolf mask, because A, it looks cool. And uh, B, nothing else matters. It's fashion souls. So, we'll just backstab this guy. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> and it's just that easy. It's just that easy. <laughs> Watch and learn, fellas. And ladies. Both of you. Observe. The Sword of Night and Flame. I actually really, I, I, do, I do still really enjoy this weapon. I think just against like certain enemies, it's maybe not, maybe not incredible. Throwing magic bombs at me, huh? Where is he? There's another one down there. Here he is. He fell down, but I didn't know where he went. Oh, what? Smithing stone. Oh, I'm glad I went back for that. Hi. Uh. I was hoping I could get both of them. I couldn't, though. Whoa! Those were arcane! How far are we going with this? Let's see. I know it wanted me to go down earlier. Wow. Yeah, I could still go down. Trap ahead. Oh, yeah, you sure? You're right! Come on. Fucking fascinating. Scythe. Okay. Now... Oh! Oh my gosh, you still keep going this way. Yeah, these are catacombs, that's right. Look at him, look at him, he thinks I don't see him. Oh, it's so funny. Did you think you blended in? That's hilarious. He had a golden rune here. No hidden path ahead, are you sure? Wait, that's the crank right there? Wait, did I already do the crank? I actually can't even remember. Did I do the crank? No, that's it. How do I get over there? I'm on the other side now. I was up there. I don't know of a way to get up there. So maybe we'll just fall down for now.
Awesome. <laughs> this is great. What's this one? Glove War 3. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, I actually didn't mean to do that, but I'll take it. Another prattling pate uh, thingy. I guess for me to say wonderful, because I think they make you say things. Hi. That was almost... That was almost no good. That was almost no good. No! Stop upvoting these! Or wait, are appraisals like... That's not just upvotes, right? It's, it's how many total upvotes and downvotes. So... Oh. If you appraise them at all... Okay. Then it counts, right? Perfect. So good. Page ashes. So many ashes. So, so many ashes, so few glove warts. Oh my god. To be frank, let's throw it. Oh god. That was quite the catacomb. An old fang. Quite the catacomb. Yep, yeah, okay, here we go. That's it. I'm gonna go uh, rest at the side of Grace before we go in. Ooh, we get to level up too. I'm gonna choose Vigor. Easy. Level 60 now. And uh, let's take a look at the Wondrous Physic Flask because for a long time I've been doing um, boosts uh, max stamina and boosts charge attack power. But now I've got a couple new cracked tiers and I'm wondering if they might be better. Significantly negates damage. I haven't been using that. Causes concoction to explode. Now why would we want that? Boosts holy attacks, boosts lightning attacks, boosts magic attacks. Restores half of your total FP. I don't really like these restorative uh, tiers because I feel like when I use the Physic, I just want to buff. Significantly negates damage. I assume that means their damage and not mine. I actually, I actually just like, I like what I have, so I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> Gotta suck myself up. No way. You again? I hate him. Er. Oh. Look at him. Now, I'm just saying that was pretty epic. Okay. go. Damn, I missed. Okay, got him. <laughs> oh no, look at this stupid face. Die. That's the third time I fought you. I can't believe it's again. Cadence Cell Sword Ashes. You get a lot of spirit ashes from these bosses, but I would like some more satisfaction. I can't believe it's the Erdry Barrel Watchdog. How many of these are there? I don't really mind repeat bosses. We've had very few, actually. I fought the Erdtree Burial Watchdog three times, and I've fought um, 
the Black Knife Assassin twice, the Cemetery Shade twice. But that's been it so far, and considering how many bosses I've fought, that's really not bad at all. But uh, I think I am getting to the point where I, I think probably we'll be kind of done with Lernia for the most part in this video, and we'll probably move on to Caleb in the next one, I think is what I've been figuring out. Oh wow, you've got a whole path over here I just didn't even see. Or not. There is something over there though. Okay, no, 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 no. We can drop down somehow, I think. Over by where the Tibia Mariner was. Oh, yeah, that's been a repeat boss too. Weirdly, not in a catacomb or anything. Just around. Um, okay, yeah, let's see if we can go to the other side here. Can I hop up? Can I hop over there? No, surely not. Okay, I'm going. Um, I'm going over this way. Okay, you can go down. Oh, oh, right here. Okay, right here. This is it. There's actually a side of grace here. This is perfect so far. Great, 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 great. Um, right here, I think. Yup. Let's go on top of the house here, because there's a guy. Give me smithing stone. Not bad. Okay. Hello, friends. get this wait did that say Jarberg can I even take these are you okay are you okay is it dead is it taking a nap so jars like flowers and I'm picking all of them it's okay though they come back it's one thing that we've figured out Ritual pot, cracked pot. So this is cool, right? I'm getting, this is a place to pick a lot of flowers and get a lot of cracked pots, apparently. Look, it's little kid jars. How come these guys aren't attacking me? They're just like dancing. How about you? You like, you like picking flowers? I just picked it for you. What, why are you peaceful? And then the other jars that I see around town, they attack me on sight. Anyone? Also, what is there to do here? Well, there's a thing on top of the house. How much you want to bet it's just a cracked pot or a ritual pot though? It's a ritual pot. Yep, confirmed. Confirmed ritual pot. Jarberg. And uh, it's just free runes. Actually. <laughs> Getting a nice uh, loot here at the graveyard. And it's, I mean, I guess that's it. Yep. Yeah. yeah, just a weird loot area. Look at all this. Look at all this blood. All these people are like, there's got to be something over there. Here I go. There's gotta be something more out there. What? Nope. Oh my gosh, I was almost an idiot with them. Why is there a graveyard here? Is this where the jars are buried? Jarberg. That, okay, that was what I saw. Weird, so this is just a little town for the jars? Question about the jars, okay? How did they get in and out of this place? Or do they just stay here? They don't leave. They just stay here and plant flowers and smell flowers and dance. This is where the peaceful jars are, not the warrior jars, I guess. Do the jars eat anything? Do they have mouths? They can talk. So much I don't know about these things. Ooh. Hello. There's something up here. 
dexterity knot crystal tear. There's just a crystal tear up here? You can't be serious. Where am I? Oh, I can't look at the... Hang on, I can't look at the map until these guys are dead. Okay. Anyway. Oh, I guess I never came to this little rock over here. Well, we got a crystal tear. I guess I'll try to use it at some point. This side of grace right here. Oh. Is this... Boil Prawn Shack? Is this the shack that that NPC was talking about? You guys probably don't even remember what I'm talking about. It was like five videos ago or something like that. We found like, there was like a gazebo with with a NPC that was like, can you go get this guy? Apparently he's boiling prawns. What are you looking at? You trying to start something, mate? Give me the necklace. Ah, that necklace what you're after, is it? Mm. Well, show me what it's worth to you and I'll consider parting ways with it. I'm not in love with it or nothing. Out, fine. What's it, what, what do you want? You're a shrewd one, Chief. First, you hand me the runes. I, I could just kill this guy. And don't try nothing, neither. Oh, it's a thousand? Oh, I am made of money. Rhea's necklace stolen by a black guard. Features a relief of a dignified looking woman from a foreign country. It appears to hold great significance for Rhea. Okay, I'll buy it. A, a thousand is nothing to me. Mm. All right. Take it. Thanks. Thanks. No damn use to anyone anyway. Your bloody idea, mate. Don't come crying to me later. Listen, I'm... Uh, I'm on a mission. Okay, so this is where she is. Okay, Rhea the Scout. Do you think... Do you think she wanted me to kill that guy? Do you think she's gonna get mad at me for like, Oh, you let him live? Cause she clearly wanted me to like... Forcibly take it back, right? I'm wondering if, uh... The motivations are as noble as she wanted me to think, you know? I'm gonna kill these guys one of these days. What? Deathbird? What the fuck? Okay. No, no problem. Okay. I just, I had no idea. Nice, dude. What the fuck is this? I was not expecting this. I feel like this isn't working, okay. How did I miss that? Okay, so... Here we go, oh! This is truly unexpected, by the way. How did I never run into this thing? No, dude! The land octopus! Okay, now... Oh, I gotta fight two enemies here, dude. This is so annoying. How'd you... This guy's a dickhead. Okay, here we go. 
Land Octopus is leaving us alone now. Red Feathered Branch Sword. Death Bird, huh? By the way, she's in this gazebo right over here. How come she never gets attacked by the Death Bird? What would she even do, run? Uh, like, not on a horse? Don't make me laugh. Do you people ever sleep, by the way? The thug should be resting at an abandoned home down the way. You got very poor Please. posture. I must have the necklace back. It looks like I've got a sword to her neck. All right, give it. Oh yes, that is my missing necklace. <laughs> it looks like I'm threatening Thank her. Thank you kindly. <laughs> I am in your debt. Did I forget to announce myself? I am Raya, in the service of Lady Tanith of the Volcano Manor. I have no idea what I that is. I seek stalwart tarnished, who might join our house. You are very brave yourself. Not only a steady hand, but a steady heart. Merciless, even to your own kind. I mean, I bought it off Such him. strength is precisely what my mistress seeks. Please, take this. That's what I'm talking about. Volcano Manor invitation! Brave tarnished. Seek the Altus Plateau. I've been there, I know where that is. The Erd tree. Most tarnished. Are doomed to wander the outskirts of the lands between, peering wistfully at the towering earth tree. But you it? are no ordinary tarnished. No. And once that is proven, the volcano manor will fully extend its invitation to fight amongst a family of champions. I see. So it's kind of like uh, Castle Canehurst in Bloodborne. You have to have an invitation. Oh, and. One more thing, only for you. This land of Liernia is connected to the Altus Plateau by the Grand Lift of Dectus. I know, I've been looking for the other half of the, the thing. Road, but the lift has been defunct for an age, meaning there's no simple means of passage. Yeah, Instead, well. you must seek the old ruins in the cliff at the base of the valley near the Grand Lift. There's an old tunnel. I've already done that. It was excavated from both ends, linking Liernia to the Altus Plateau. I have faith in you, a champion through and through. You're not gonna tell me about I the magma worm? That we can meet again. You're not gonna tell me about the magma worm? Yeah. So I've already done that. I'm, I'm glad you wish we could meet. I'm sure I'll see you at the Volcano Manor or whatever. Wow. Okay. So I'm glad I did that. That was cool. A little death bird action. Um, by the way, I want to go down here because I never, I never went down to the southern end of the lake. I never went down there. I always went to the merchant and then I was like, well, that's that. All right. Here we are in the southern part of the lake. I would show you on the map, but I'm apparently quote in combat right now. So can't. Let's take a look. Right here, maybe I can. Is that nineteen? Oh, there's jellyfish over there, and is that? Yeah, I think that over there needs a stone sword key, which means I might have to go buy one. Oh, yep, there is a cave. Okay, I misunderstood. I saw one of the jellyfish, uh, and I thought it was like a, one of those mist veils or whatever. Stillwater cave, yeah. This is probably the last cave I'm gonna explore. Um, we'll just have to move on after this, frankly. Oh my god. I'm gonna have fun roasting this thing, like. This thing. Oh. I don't think so. Now, I don't have my flasks. Hang on, I'm gonna go rest and get my flasks. Dexterity not. Temporarily boost dexterity. I think that's better than charged attack power. Is the charged attack power even doing anything for my Sword of Night and Flame? 
Let's try it. My dexterity is up. Let's see. Let me see what it does. Dexterity 26? It was 12. That's a boost of 14 dexterity? That's pretty good, actually. A boost of 14? I thought it was gonna be like, oh, you get two additional dexterity. 14? I'm not, I wasn't, uh, miss, uh, remembering that, right? Like, I had 12 dexterity. Gotcha. We got the lantern on, don't we? Oh yeah, we did have it on. It just wasn't really doing much. Plant. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's cool. Can I get them from here? This is funny. Okay, maybe I'll just go down there in a little bit and take care of that. Armor ahead, oh sweet, really? Could always use new armor. Honestly, the armor I'm using ain't that great. Oh, of course it's in the poison water. Sage hood, sage robe. Oh, these are good for like a, a caster. Wow, uh, I'm poisoned, uh, whatever. Not that it matters. Come here. There we go. You weren't singing! I'm so proud of you! Serpent arrow. Okay, so we got a little loot cave here, which I'm grateful for. Thank you. I'm probably not gonna take those, uh... That intelligence armor. But... I, I appreciate... That I could go down there and get it, you know? Let's see, I'm wondering... Look at you. Yeah, look at that. Wow, look at all that. I mean, if I'm already poisoned, I can just kind of sit here and wail on it, right? Because there's no reason not to at that point. Like, I mean, I'm just staying poisoned. It's not a big deal. But I do want to get my uh, heal ready. Right? Here we go. See, I got unpoisoned, but then... <sighs> what? Wait, look! Look! It's still building up! How's it still building up? We got a dickhead over here. Oh my god. Oh my god, I got poisoned again. It's all good. We got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him! Uh, 
I'll just deal with it. I'll deal with the poison. Here we go. These things, dude, they don't die. I forgot that it had an actual attack and it wasn't just gonna- Cause it was just sitting there doing poison clouds forever and I was like, well I'll just wail on it. I'm gonna continue going around. Hey dickheads. Yeah? Yeah, you good? Okay. I'm gonna take this. Oh, a glowstone. I still don't really know what that- what that does. Um, there we go. I gotta get my runes, which are right there, actually. Oh my gosh. Look at him. Ooh, I've got lots of poison. Ooh, I love poison. Can I roast him? I might just roast him. Can I roast him from here? Ah, <laughs> I'm gonna get it anyway. I'm gonna get poison anyway. Fucking. It's probably because the armor I'm wearing has low poison resist or something. Oh, it's a Steak America. Nice, man. Well, if I'm already poisoned, I'll just wander through this. Uh-huh. Toxic mushroom. Thanks, dude. What are you guys like worshiping? Look, they're they're like bowing down. You got a poison waterfall over here. That's very impressive. I'll kill all these guys. I don't care. You think I care? I'll stab a guy in the back. I don't have any honor. It's your fault. Ooh, poison grease. It's your fault for, uh, sitting like that. Oh my gosh. I should probably just go in, right? Let's just... Yeah. Oh, what could it possibly even be? Clean rot night. Okay. Let's get this. Dude, you're getting poisoned. What's this? <laughs> oh! Oh, that did a million fucking damage! Oh, clean rot night! Perfect clear, no damage! Wing and sword insignia. That's what you got? Okay. Yeah. Wow, Jellyfish, you got him. He- they even lived in poison, and you were doing damage to them. Now that's... I don't know how I feel about that. They were literally walking around in poison water, and they were getting damaged by you, a poison jellyfish. Riddle me that. Ooh, uh, 23 Vigor, I believe. I need some more mind, actually. I need to make sure that I get that at some point. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're back here, because I have some unfinished business. And you may know what I'm talking about. What the hell was that? Oh, 
I one shot the shade. I one shot it. Like I said, this weapon just got nerfed. This is after the nerf. Twin Sage Sorcerer Ashes. I mean, you have to, you have to have, what is it, like 48, uh, 72 points of stats to use it, so. He must have been really weak to fire. Oh, here you are reading, weeding their death root. We finally beat him. One hit. You know, it makes sense though. It makes sense because honestly, like, he had very low defense as it was. It was just hitting him. That was the issue. But magic is the way to go against those cemetery shades. It's like, I feel like if you, if you go in with a magic user against that thing, it's just, I mean, you just range him down. But melee, it's hard to get in there. Okay, let's hand over both our death root. Uh-huh. Strange. There's something else. Yeah? But the death yet quenches. I'm glad to hear it. Bring more. Ash of War, Beast War, and Bestial Vitality. So we got an incantation and an Ash of War. Of course, uh, you don't really use the Ash of War with the sword, so... I don't plan on using the sword for the rest of the game, frankly. Just for a little bit, like... I think I plan on maybe switching it back up to dual wielding something. If I find another curved sword I like, I might go like dex build. Especially with this mixed uh, physic that I got now where it boosts your dexterity by 12. That's really good. Um... What else can I even do in Lyrnia for now? I mean, other than going into the Ainsel River well, and uh, we can't go into the uh, Divine Tower, like I said, we can't do that yet until we're done with Ronnie's quest, which involves going to the Nokron Eternal City, which involves going to Kaled first to the, the Festival of Radon or whatever it is. So we're gonna do that next video. Um, I'm trying to figure out, like, what else, what else we can do in this one. I mean, I might go down to the Ainsel River well. I don't know, how does that sound? I want to try something. Oh, 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 that was awesome. Oh yeah, you want to test your luck? Holy... I don't know how that guy got out of it. That was... incredible. Let me get behind him. <laughs> okay, dude. Yes! Unfortunately, these guys don't give that many, like... Runes for for killing them. Oh, I don't have any left. Anyway, yeah, we don't have to sit here and murder these guys, but just wanted to clean out a bunch of them. Wow. Uh, let's go ahead and just pop this. Maybe pop this too. little bubble spell don't make me laugh now uh, there is that thing up there I don't know how how are we gonna kill that thing Ow! Uh, let's go to this merchant I can't remember what he has but maybe he has something good okay yeah I remember this merchant he's well, just hanging out here there you are again yep divorce from one's trade does not come easily yeah what do you have again? Ooh, cookbooks. I'm gonna buy these. Yep. I'll buy that. And that. We got Lost Ashes of War to duplicate Ash of War. Got a couple consumables here, which I'm not a big fan of. And Celestial Dew, which I... It's so expensive, and it's like, for what reason, you know? Actually, I'm gonna sell a bunch of stuff. Because I have a lot of stuff I'm never gonna use. Okay, I just sold a bunch of uh, extra armor I had. Thankfully, it doesn't count against you, like, um, the weight, I guess. 
Okay, so it looks like the way that we're supposed to go now... Jeez, calm down. I was gonna look at the, uh... Yeah, but it's down here. It's, uh, this way. This way. Pretty sure, so. I guess we can go up there later, you know? Ooh, a side of grace. This would have been way easier if I had just come here. But I didn't know. I didn't know that. <laughs> okay. So this is where we are, and we can continue going along the river this way, and there's this whole big area over here that we haven't been to. So I'm excited to check it out. Oh, ants, dude. Ants. How much do you think they're paying attention? I don't think I can do a backstab. They're like, they're like not paying attention at all. So I guess we can just... Oh. We can just kill them, okay. Now you may remember there was a uh, ant colony earlier. I wonder if, ooh, immunizing horn charm. Is that a talisman? Immunizing horn charm, what does it do? Raises immunity, right, 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 right. That makes sense. That is exactly what it should do. Crystal dart, so, let's see. This can't go that far, and then the river keeps going that way, so. We'll go through here. It's probably just a little cave, or... No? Formic rock? Oh. What the hell? What the hell is this thing? It's like a little lizard. Wait, are y'all... Are y'all aggressive? Did I just murder you? Oh, they're aggressive. Okay, they're aggressive. I mean, I just killed their friends, so... Okay, I wasn't thinking that this was gonna go much further. Look, we're going, oh, okay. It's all red over here, y'all. <gasps> Somber smithing stones and uh, tons of Aeonian butterfly. Whoa, what the hell is this? I'm guessing we don't wanna be in that. Okay, so there's a whole area over here. Look, the river goes this way, so maybe we're supposed to go... This is like giving us a sneak preview. So the river well down here actually has a lot of different areas. Okay, so we got more uh, ants here. I'm just gonna keep... Uh, taking it slow. Alright, what do we got here? Yep. How big is that guy? Wow, it's like the hidden village in um in Bloodborne. You aren't a boss, are you? Are you a boss? I see you on loading screens. How could you possibly be a boss? Dude, you sat in a throne until you died. How could I take you seriously? We're seeing the stars things again. What the fuck? Dragonkin Soldier of Noxtella. No worries, dude. Nice. Leave my jellyfish alone. He didn't do anything to you. Dude, even without the special ability, this sword just actually does pretty decent damage. Oh, oh. 
Oh, wow, okay. Here we go. Couldn't get up fast enough. I thought I had enough time to heal. Okay, so the second stage is a bastard. All right. Okay, I gotta go get this. Yo, excuse me. If you could attack the leg, that would be great. Just whenever you feel like it. Ooh, gotcha. He was scary in his second phase. Oh, I got an achievement for that. Dragonkin Soldier of Noxtella. There it is. Frozen Lightning Spear. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I am enjoying the sword still, but I think I will switch to a different build at some point, you know? Can't keep it up forever. Wow, he got really distracted by the jellyfish. Jellyfish OP, I gotta say. Jellyfish, doing a great job. Keep it up. Proud of you. Ooh, a chest. This is a fancy chest. Great ghost glove wart. That's used for spirit ashes. Yeah, look at it. It's past three. Strengthen renowned ashes to plus ten. Well, what's in between plus three and plus ten? That's insane. So that's like... That's if you want to really max out the spirit ashes, you know? Um... Okay, well, interestingly... Is this kind of a dead end here, actually? It certainly kind of seems that way. Grace ahead. Dude, there is no way that you don't die from jumping off of this. Am I, am I wrong? Grace ahead. Okay, huh? How'd you die? Yeah, did you fall? Did you fall and die? Yeah, that's a death right there. No, no, no. That's not happening. Okay, you know what? You know what I'm gonna do? Let's see. I just need like 2,000 more runes um, to level up, so I'm gonna level up real quick, and then I'm just gonna jump. I'm gonna try it. And we'll level up. Vigor. Nice. Okay. Now I'm gonna jump. Oh, Grace ahead? Great, I'll jump off the waterfall and live. Can't wait to live. Right? Just like this guy. This guy lived. Alright, here I go. Here I go. Wow, can't wait to hit the Grace. Yeah. Oh, I see. 
So I went through here, but you need to go through the river around here. No, there's actually... Okay, there is a way. There is a way to do this. I'll show you. I've scouted it all out. Oh my freaking god. We're gonna kill that thing, by the way. There's a path up there that you can get... You can get to. Okay. Here we go. So, out here, instead of going in... That, we're gonna go around to the side. This little riverway over here should lead us to elevated ground. I'm gonna start rushing through this, so don't worry about it. See that guy up there? See, now we got this. And then we're gonna take this hidden pathway This thing, up here. Uh-huh. God, this thing's so annoying, dude. Die. Uh-huh. Yeah. Dude. Uh, revenge, yes! I was hoping it would say it. I was hoping it would say revenge. Fuck off. Huh? What do you not have the right to do here? Is it just expressing frustration? What, this? This isn't... Yeah. Okay. For some reason, like, earlier when I saw this up here, I was like, Oh, you must have to come from this way to go kill it. But no, you drop down from up there. Um, now with that said... Uh... We are up pretty high. Oh, you drop down here. Okay. Anyway, now we gotta go all the way back. Ugh. I assume that that thing is permanently dead. Because otherwise... This would be really frustrating. <laughs> shield grease? Oh, for shields. Well, we don't have to worry about that. Look, I even have a shield. Who do I think I'm fooling? Okay. There's a couple of things to, um... Find out here. Like, uh, treasure. Smithing stone one. Okay, I think I'm a little bit old for that, but sure, whatever. Okay, we're gonna hop up here. And uh right here. There's something. Yep. Smithing stone three. <gasps> That's what I get for trying to be fancy. Okay, got my runes back. Oh my gosh, please don't do this to me. There we go. Okay, now, just to give you an idea of what we're planning. So we're up here now, we're gonna try to go through here. If we can. Um, which there might not be a way, actually. Is it way up there? Oh no, there might not be a way to get through, actually. Oh. Huh. Yeah, I don't think there's actually a way through. I think this is actually a way down. But then... So what, do you like start here? Okay, I looked it up, and actually, believe it or not, this whole area, this, 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 can't get to it yet. And it's actually locked by the exact same thing that's blocking off the, uh, Divine Tower. We gotta finish Ronnie's quest. Oh, which means we gotta go to Kaled. So we're gonna do that in the next video, I guess. Cause I'm pretty much, I, I'm pretty much done with Lyurnia. Like I'm not done with it, but I think I'm, I'm done with it for now. I've, I've reached a stopping point, a pausing point, I guess really is 
more like what I mean. But starting next video, we're gonna be going to Kaled. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Kaled! Kaled time. We've been putting it off for so long, but we're finally going to dive in and uh, see what this rust colored paradise is all about. But before we do that, I'll take us out. Uh, I'll show this one. Ooh, this is a nice view. All right, so in this video, we uh, uncovered a lot of different caves, a lot of different optional bosses, beat all of them. I don't think there's any outstanding bosses remaining that I know of in this region. Um, I haven't forgotten about Crucible Knight and Limgrave. We'll just, we'll come back to that when we can. Found some cool weapons, did some, even did some Riverwell stuff, which I wasn't expecting to do. And, uh, yeah, it was basically just, like, tying up a bunch of loose ends. Kind of like I did in, uh, what was it? Part 4. I did that for Limgrave. So, um, things are going along pretty well. And next video, we're gonna start checking out Kaled. All this. Because, uh, from what I've been told, this is what we need to do next. Kaled. And then, when we're done with Kaled, then we can move on to the Altus Plateau, which I went into, uh, a couple parts ago, and I was like, ooh, I'm coming back to this. A whole new region, starting next video, new bosses, um, all sorts of new stuff. I think from now on, bear with me, I think from now on, I'm going to minimally explore the caves, because I can feel myself getting a little bit overleveled, and I want to keep the game interesting. I'll probably change weapons soon to something else. I'll respec. I'll get another larval tier. I know where to get one. There's one in, uh, um, down here in Siofra. There's one down here. There's like a merchant right here that sells one. So I can do that at any time. I might go more of like a dual wheel dex thing because I like getting up in the enemy's faces and stuff. But, uh, I think my exploration of Kaled is going to be decidedly less thorough than of the previous two regions, but that doesn't mean I'm gonna rush through it. I'm just maybe not gonna explore every cave and every optional boss. We will see how I feel though when I get there. Might decide, you know what, I really do wanna explore every optional cave. Now the first thing that we're gonna do in the next video, uh, Guile Tunnel here is where Sir Iron Alexander is. He wants to get into the festival. However, the uh, there's a door that's locked. So that means that there's some other way into the tunnel somewhere around here that we're gonna have to look for. We're gonna have to go in and let him in. We've also got the Radon Festival and all sorts of stuff to check out. Uh, should be a good time. And that's what I got planned. So thanks for watching the series. Hope you're enjoying it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Think critically.